One Lafayette man dying of lung cancer got quite the surprise this afternoon. Friends and family wanted to celebrate 77-year-old Dennis Clark with an antique car parade. News 18's Micah Upshaw shows us more. I, I think he's going to be very surprised. It'll be great. By the looks of his reaction, surprised is right. Dennis Clark's niece, Sherry Clark Ludlow, is one of the organizers for her uncle's car parade. He had a hobby of collecting antique cars. Now under this pandemic, Sherry says this is the best way to honor her uncle while still practicing social distancing. It's his passion. People and antiques and having meaning behind what he does and how he feels. Um, and that's why we all come together. Dennis was diagnosed with terminal lung cancer before the COVID-19 pandemic. Since home visits and in-person contact has become limited, lead organizer and close friend Don Van Dame says this is one way to remind Dennis he's got a community full of support. Denny has been a dear friend to us and we're just trying to give back a little bit and uh, let him know how much we love him. Nearly 100 people came out to support Dennis's car parade. Close friend Rusty Hart says this outpour of people shows the kind of impact Dennis holds. Thrilled to see all these people show up to bring their cars and do a little parade past his house and hopefully lift his spirits a little bit. That's what it's all about. I think he's gonna, it's really going to put a smile on his face, and right now that's what, it's what we all need, but especially Dennis. Reporting in Battleground, Micah Upshaw, News 18. Well, Dennis Clark has deep roots in Lafayette. He served as the president of Lafayette Glass Company since 1972.